Hi everyone, welcome to Glow's Kendron Kitchen and I'm Glow. Well today I wanted to share with you a salad that I make quite often and I would say probably at least once a week and uh, it is so easy and so delicious and you can trade it up with whatever you have in the refrigerator and today I'm serving this with some smothered hamburger steaks and mashed potatoes and gravy but um, I wanted to share this with you. What I have here is probably about a cup of romaine lettuce that I already washed and um, you know tore into bite-sized pieces and then I have probably about a quarter of a cup of green pepper. This is just stuff I had in the refrigerator. About a half of the um, stalk of, um, or rib rather, of celery. I have about a third or maybe even like, it depends on the size of your English cucumber. This is probably three quarters of a cup. So, and I have one medium or actually more like a small to medium tomato look at that tomato isn't that just beautiful for this time of year you just don't see that very very often. red miss glow very red colorful and i have some chopped mint from my garden i have some fresh parsley and all of these ingredients just add so much flavor so i'm going to go ahead and just pour that right in my bowl here And then I have probably three quarters of a cup of berries here. I have blackberries, I have raspberries, and blueberries. Just wipe my hand off here. Then what I do is I have olive oil, extra virgin olive oil, and I go around the outer perimeter of my bowl three times. And then I love this white balsamic vinegar. If you guys have never tried white balsamic vinegar, give it a try. Really good. Mm -hmm. And I'm gonna, one, two, three. But I do the inner part of the bowl with that. Why is that, Miss Chloe? Because you don't want as much vinegar um, in your dressing as you do olive oil. It's okay. a little too overpowering. Then I just sprinkle just a tad of sugar. That was maybe a half a teaspoon at the most. And then I lightly sprinkle salt on. Not much. And the same with black pepper. And that's all there is to it. Then you just mix it up. Look how beautiful that is. Looks good. Like I said, you can use any kind of vegetables and fruits you have in your refrigerator. And you can just switch it up. Isn't that pretty? So pretty, so pretty. So then what I'm going to do is I dampened a paper towel. I'm going to put that right over the top. And I'm going to put this in my refrigerator until dinner is ready. That way this is going to be super crisp. And oh, is it going to be delicious. I'll be back in a bit. We're going to try it together. Well, look at this salad, you guys. Doesn't that look delicious? does. And now it's time for the taste test. I had it in the um, refrigerator for about 15 minutes. I'm get a raspberry too. These type of salads are so refreshing. Mmm. You can taste the parsley and the mint with this as well as with the berries and cucumbers and those tomatoes. Oh, let me see that again there. Mm mm mm. Mm hmm. Looks good. That dressing is not overpowering at all. It's just perfect with a salad like this. You can put whatever fruits you wanted in this or veggies that you had in your refrigerator. And you can just play it up each time, make it a little bit different. You can use a different vinegar with it and that would be delicious. I've done it with balsamic, with um, red wine vinegar. They're all delicious. 
But anyway, I hope you've enjoyed this. And if you have, we would really appreciate it if you would like and subscribe to our channel and uh, share with your friends and um, give me a comment. We'll talk to you later. Bye.